Hello everyone, welcome back to One Blood Moon. Today we are playing Mausoleum. It's a horror game. I'm loving the art style already. Hello, priest. Priest Carlos, young assistant. It's good to have you here in these dark moments we are living. As you already know, our community is being invaded by forces of the underworld. The eye of evil watches us frighteningly from high in the sky. Thousands have perished and thousands more have been seduced by the false promises of the cult. Our mission is to guide our congregation towards divine light and protect it. What can we do? We? Oh no. I'm just an old man. There's not much I can do. That's why I've urgently asked you to come. There is a task that I need you to carry out right away with your vigorous youth. The church cemetery is infested with pagan symbols hung by the cult members. These pendants increase the power of darkness and bring it closer to our sanctuary. This church is the last stronghold of humanity in our town. We must stop the advance of evil by any means. I need you to destroy the nine symbols and come back. Alright, I'll get to work. Thank God you're here. Let's go, there's no time to waste. The symbols are everywhere. Search fairly in every corner of the cemetery. Ah, and one more important thing. If you see anyone strange out there, don't look at them. Don't talk to them. The cult will try to break your faith. They will even put illusionary images in your young and beautiful mind. Resist. Young and beautiful, eh? Um, why, I'm getting Slender Man vibes here. It's just a chalice. Why have you got a hatch, father? It's firmly closed. Is that your escape hatch? <laughs> One outside your gates? How bold of them. A mausoleum. Home boom fur. Oh, unfortunate soul. Wonder when the monster appears. It is closed with a key. Does the dear father have the key? Okay. Is it a trap? Oh. Hello, up there. Father told me I can't have any new friends. My apologies. Oh. 
That was shocking. A corpse quite common in a cemetery. He would have funk it. No, more friends. Ah, we got the key. Let's keep our eyes to the ground. How many is a nine? I thought it was eight. Oh, oh. Jeez, these cultists are a little bit weird. <laughs> what kind of cult is this? Oh, we're summoning demons now. Since the hatch to the cemetery. Or is this a secret ending? I've been led right to the cult, aren't I? Cam Gorda. What perversions have you been up to, priest? A video camera. This is very strange. And tools. Instruments of torture. Why is this here? Right underneath the priest. What happened here? Oh, we can guess. It can't be opened. It seems this room is right beneath the church. I know your secrets now. The Lord may forgive you, for I can't. Still alive. Have you completed your task, young man? Have you destroyed all the symbols? Have you? Hmm. It is done. Well done, young man. We have a great challenge ahead, but we have started the battle. You have proven to be a faithful warrior of God. The sunlight shines bright again for now. Kirk, we're defeated. No. Okay, I assume there was a second ending. You wave the flag of your faith like a candle in the storm. You seek the light to guide your steps through the darkness. Nothing erodes all the solidarity of your convictions. You are a warrior of God. Will God answer your prayers? You have resisted. That symbol looks very familiar. Okay, let's try that again. Game wasn't too long. 
I'm assuming there's a second ending. Okay, let's see if he does anything different this time. Have you completed your task, young man? Have you destroyed all the symbols? Not yet, lie. And what are you waiting for? We have no time to lose if we want to save what's left of this town. What's under the church? Nothing. Just an old basement full of spiders. No need to go there. Why are you lying to me? It's firmly closed. Okay, can you speak to me? Doghead. Hello. Who are you, and what are you doing here? I am a normal person, just casually strolling through the cemetery. Could you do me a huge favour? I need you to pour some of my blood into the chalice in the church, please. Why would I do that? Good question. You see, my group and I are trying to change the world. And for that, it was necessary to completely remodel that old church. What do you think? Would you help us make this world a better place? Yes, the world needs a change. Perfect. You won't regret it. The world will be a beautiful place thanks to your help. Probably know the priest isn't a good guy. Here's where that guy wants me to pour his blood. Pour the blood into the chalice ending who let the dog in. You let it in! You let it in! You let it in! I let it in. Okay. 